Hi guys, my name's Mitz and I'm going to show you how to firstly find your router pass uh, IP address okay and the next thing I'm going to show you is how to put security um, settings on your router just very simple I'm not going to go into too much detail okay so firstly how we're going to find out the router number because sometimes they're different so I'm going to go right down into the corner um, and where the taskbar pops up so I've got Windows 7 or whatever now all we have to do is go to this network icon here and open up the network and sharing center so if you have got something different um, all you have to do is go to control panel and look for the networking section okay now in here we have connections so we're just going to click on it and we're going to click on details okay so look at all these details here okay so I've got my IP address and all that so here's the default gateway okay so I'm gonna go close that close that close that and then I'm gonna go and open up an internet browser and put that in and it takes you to the home page okay so you put the IP address in that I just found and it takes you to the home page of your router okay so this could possibly take you to a wireless modem or whatever okay so just try a couple of IP addresses out of that details section if you don't know and you'll come across something like this now this has got a few things here so we can just go to the security section see how it has um, uh, under wireless it says security so well, they're all different okay so they'll have a menu down the side or something and I'm um, just going to go through on this one and it says security mode is disabled so we can go 64 bit 128 bit or the uh, most recent one is WPA or WPA2 okay so here we go we're right here and um, it's given me the options here now this here is where we put the password in now I'm changing this um, changing the IP and all that anyway so that's okay so anyway you can click on this and there is the password for my internet right now by the time anyone sees this video of course this would have changed um, but we can obscure it but it's very easy to see it even if um, you're on a computer where it has that automatic login um, yeah so it's better off not sharing your password now at this stage right now we can change that password and all we have to do is apply the changes now I'm not going to do that I'm just going to um, clear the changes I'm not going to do anything okay I'm going to go back up here put disabled back on it now I just want to show you how to um, enable a password so what that's going to mean is that anyone that wants to connect to the internet in your house or on your network is going to need that password alright um, thanks for watching I hope that was pretty easy for you